Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today I'll be showing you how to make all of these modded outfits in GTA 5 online. So I hope you do enjoy these. If you do, a like would be hugely appreciated. Also, if you want to, you can subscribe, but you don't have to. Yeah, so I don't want to waste your time, so shout out to all of these people on screen for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So to start off, you want to come to any clothing store on the map, so it doesn't matter which one, just go to anyone. And from here, you want to put the required amount of money inside of your bank. So it is a lot, including the SWAT outfit, um, but it's way cheaper if you don't add the SWAT outfit into it, so it's up to you. From here though, equip the outfit you'd like to keep as by doing a glitch, it deletes all your saved outfits, and then delete all your saved outfits yourself just to be safe. Um, and after you've done so, you can go to swap character. Now, in order for the glitch to work, you will need your main character to be a male, and it needs to be on the left slot. If it isn't, this glitch won't work for you. And from here, make a new female character in the right slot. And if you do get an alert, accept the alert. From here, you want to make sure it is set to a female, then hit save and continue. Name the character anything, then take a photo, and you should load into a public session. Uh, now quickly, before we do get into it further, I do just want to let you know if you'd like any of your own modded accounts, a common modded outfits on them, and plenty of cash and RP, be sure to check out MitchCactus.com. These modded accounts come with cash ranging from 50 million all the way to 1 billion, and almost all of the modded accounts now are 100% cash, so no need for extra cars and deluxos. They also offer account boosts, which is amazing because you can get an already existing account boosted with tons of money and RP. These guys have over 4,500 reviews on their official Trustpilot page and are by far the most highly reputable modders. I'll leave a link to the website in the description below and also the pinned comment. Also don't forget you can use my code TJRH for 5% off your order for a limited time only. When you load in you want to check to see if you have any clothing stores on your map. If you do just go to one, however if you don't you need to find a new session. From here, just head over to the casino. In the casino, you just want to turn some of your money into chips. So just take out around 20,000 and then head over to the casino clothing section. Go on sports jackets and equip the maroon broker puffer at the bottom, so it's only about 11,000 chips. From here though, you want to go to a clothing store. Now in the clothing store, head down to tank tops and you want to go for the two-tone tank. So this one here. After you have this, you want to head over to the pan section. So on this menu here, um, what you want to do is go on sports pants and go for the spotted muscle pants. Then after you have these, go to shoes. Now on shoes, go on to high heel boots and go for the deluxe midnight combat boots. And once you have those, you want to go over to the accessories menu. And from here, take off any earrings or accessories that are on your outfit, and then go on gloves and go for the light woodland armoured. So again, if you have any accessories, take them off. And from here, you just want to go ahead and save this outfit in slot number two, and just name it the same as I do, so this is for the SWAT outfit. Um, by the way, if you don't want to do the SWAT outfit, you don't have to, uh, since it does cost a lot. Now the reason it costs a lot is because you need a certain outfit on Arena War outfits. Go down to the Space Traveller suits. You need to purchase a white Space Traveller and then save it in slot 3. Now just go ahead and re-equip the first outfit here, so equip this one. And once you do have it, you want to go onto the top section. And then head down to Work Jackets. And go for the Peach Camo Closed Field, so number 38. If it is on open, just open up your interaction menu, go to style, set it to closed, and from here you want to go down to tucked t-shirts, equip number 75, the blue digital t-shirt. And then after you have this, you can go ahead and save this, uh, but save it in slot number 4. Once you have it saved, you want to head over to the pants section. And then just head down to leather pants and you want to go for the red ribbed. So up here, the red ribbed. Once you have these, 
all you want to do is go over to tops. On tops, you want to head down to the bomber jackets and then go for the red double P varsity. So number 59. And you can keep the gloves and shoes the same and now go ahead and save this in slot number five and then name it the same as I do. From here, head down to the leather jackets and you want to go for the blue cropped biker. So this one here, the blue cropped biker. Then head down to tucked t-shirts and equip the black classic. So this one here, the black classic. After you've got all this, all you need to do is go to pants. Go to sports pants, give them the spotted muscle pants. And then after that, you want to head over to shoes. Now head down to the sneakers, go for the pink plane high tops. And then just go ahead and save this. So save it to slot number six. Now for the next outfit, you want to go over to the front desk and then head down to the standard outfits. So outfit standard, equip the first one. So number one, after you got this, go to accessories. Now go on to earrings and take them off. Then head down to necklaces and you need to find the white pearl necklace. So on here, go down to the white pearl necklace and then equip that one. And then you want to save this in slot number seven and name it white one. After you've saved it, you want to head over to pants, then head on to utility pants and you want to go for the cream knee pad cargos. So just up here, the cream knee pad cargos, then just head over to leather bomber jackets. Now I did pause the recording after this and I forgot to unpause it until a bit later on so I missed out on making all the outfits so this is why it's a different clip showing you how to make the outfits uh, because I accidentally didn't show it before um, but it's still the exact same I'm just showing you exactly what to equip uh, it's just a different character that's why it looks different yeah so anyway carrying on with the outfit just go for the multicolor SN leather closed on leather bomber jackets like I just did uh, so from here once you have that go to gloves and equip the blue surgical gloves and then go on to earrings you want to go for the B&W deco earrings so number 40. Once you have these, you want to go ahead and save this in slot number eight. Now that you have that saved, you want to go over to the pants section. So over here, go on to sports pants and go for the spotted muscle pants. Now go on to shoes, go on boots, and then go for the red cowboy boots. And then from here, you just want to go over to the top section Head down to leather jackets. So leather jackets, go for the blue cropped biker. Then head down to bustiers and go for the teal lace bustier. Once you have the teal lace bustier, go on to caps forward. Then equip the grey woodland cap. This is if you want that white cap. You don't have to equip it. Go on gloves and equip the light woodland armoured. Then after you have those, you want to go ahead and save this in slot number 9 and name it white 3. From here you want to head over to pants, go to utility pants and then go for the black battle pants. So up here, I'll go for these ones. And after you have these, go to tops and you want to head down to the sports jackets. So on sports jackets, go for the sea green puffer jacket. This one here. And after this, go down to bustiers. You want to go for the white lace bustier. Now, once you got this, you want to go to the accessories menu and then go on gloves. Now, on this, just equip the black woolen gloves. So, these here. And then you also want to take off your earrings and your hat.
once you do all that, you just want to go ahead and save this in slot number 10. You can name this whatever you want to, uh, but do the same as I do just to make it easier for you. Next up, you want to go on shoes, then go on to the boots, go for the red cowboy boots, and then go on to the pants section. So just over here, you want to go down to sports pants and then go for the spotted muscle pants. Then once you have all that, you can just go ahead and save this in slot number 11. And there you go, you should now have all the outfits saved. So what you need to do from here is just back out on the menu and then open up your interaction menu. Take the easy way out just to force the game to save. When you respawn, you want to open up your pause menu, go to online and start up creator. Now in creator, you want to create a race and then make a new land race. Now go on the race details and then just fill them in so the title description and the photo, they can be anything, they don't matter. What does matter is you need to set the max players to 3 and the route type to point to point. And then if you want to, you can choose a supercar, but from here, warp to the airport. Now from here, you want to place the trigger anywhere and then take a photo of anything for the lobby camera. And I'll just place checkpoints until the race is at least 0.62 miles long. So until that red warning icon goes away and it should let you test the race. So after it's gone away, just test the race. After you've completed the race, you should have this alert here, so accept the alert, open up your pause menu, then go to online and go to choose character. In this menu here, you need to delete your female character, so make sure it is your female character you're deleting, not your main one. Then type delete to confirm or whatever it is, just make sure you delete it. And after you've done this, what you need to do from here is if you're on old gen or you're on PC, simply back out to story mode, so press B for Xbox or circle for PlayStation. However, if you are on next gen, what you need to do is hover over the second character and then you need to join someone else in an online session who's in a different targeting mode to you and that way it will take you back to story mode instead. In story mode, just start up a new online invite only session. In online, you'll notice you have the outfit you chose to keep at the beginning of the video. So from here, you want to go ahead and save this outfit at the bottom. So it's slot number 20. You should also notice all the outfits from the female have transferred over. So what you want to do from here is you want to equip the second outfit and then equip the gloves you would like with the SWAT outfit. So I'll just go for some black woolen gloves. And then from here, what you need to do is go ahead and delete this outfit. So delete the second outfit, this one here. Make sure you delete it. And from here, open up your pause menu, go to online jobs, play job, go onto bookmarked, then go down to missions and startup. It's a G thing. So you'll have to bookmark this. I'll leave a link to it in the description. In this menu, set the clothing to player saved outfits and then invite anyone and start this up. Now, for some reason, it didn't record it, but when you load into the menu here, you just scroll two to the right on owned outfit and then just ready up. When you load in, you'll notice you have this outfit, so all you want to do from here is go to any of your apartments and go to the wardrobe inside of your apartment. Now inside of your wardrobe, all you want to do is go ahead and save this, so save it at the bottom, so to slot number 19, just out of the way of all the other outfits. And then from here, what you want to do is just quit the job using your phone. Now from here you'll notice the outfit is fully saved so you can equip it using your interaction menu. But from here what you want to do is go to any clothing store. In a clothing store go on to biker suits and equip the black biker suit. Then go on to online jobs, play job. 
got the bookmarked, go down to missions and start up it's a G thing once again. So once you're on a mission, set the clothing to player saved outfits and then invite anyone and start it up. In this menu here, just scroll all the way to the right until you get to the Trash 2 outfit. So this one here, and then from here, ready up. And then of course, in the mission, you want to go to any apartment wardrobe. In here, just go ahead and save it at the bottom, so this time to slot number 18, or just anywhere out of the way of the other outfits. And then you can name this whatever you want to, but from here you need to delete all the outfits up until the white one outfit, so delete trash one and two, and then the SWAT outfits two. Then from here, quit the job using your phone. Now when you load in, you want to go to a clothing store. In here, go on to outfits saved, and then go to the white one outfit and then equip this one here. Once you have this, you just want to go to the pants section and head down to cargo pants. Go for all the light grey large cargos. Once you have those, you want to go onto shoes and then head on to boots and equip any boots that tuck in the pants. So any of these that tuck in. So just go for whichever ones, doesn't matter. And then from here, go on t-shirts and equip the black t-shirt. Once you have all that, you just want to open up your pause menu, go to online jobs, play job, go down to missions, uh, on bookmarked, go down to missions, and then start up it's a G thing once again. And yet again, you want to set the clothing to player saved outfits and then invite anybody and start this up. In this menu here, just scroll three to the right on owned outfit and then ready up. So until you have the white three outfit, and then just ready up. Now in the mission, just go to any apartment wardrobe. In here, just go ahead and save this out of the way of all the others, so to slot number 17, or wherever. Uh, name it whatever you want to. But once you have saved this, you need to delete the three outfits that you used to make this, so white, one, two, and three. Delete those. And then just quit the job using your phone, and when you spawn in, go to a clothing store. Now go on to Arena War Tops, and you want to go on to Nightmare, and then head down to the red E Cola hockey shirt. And then just equip the red E Cola hockey shirt, so this one here. Once you have this, open up your pause menu, go to Online, Jobs, Play Job, Bookmarked. Then head out to missions and start up it's a G thing once again. Set the clothing to player saved outfits and then invite anyone and start this up. Now in this menu just scroll two to the right and then ready up. Now from here go to your apartment wardrobe. And then in here, go ahead and save this at the bottom, so this time you can save this to any slot as it's all done. Once you have it saved, you can quit the job using your phone. And there you go, that's all the outfits done for this video, so I hope you like them, and I hope you did find this helpful. If you did, a like would be hugely appreciated. Also, if you made it to the end, comment down below that you did, and I'll try and hire your comment. Anyway, thank you for watching, have an awesome day or night, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.